Hey guys, so uh, if you guys are having any problems with your DS4 and uh, you can't seem to figure out the solution, I think I might be able to help you guys. So with DS4, there's typically two problems. Um, either you're rocking the old DS4, which is this one, which is the black logo one, or um, you've actually downloaded the, the new version, the V2 version, and you've deleted this one, yet every time you open it, you're still using the V1 version and you can't figure out why. And V2 and the V1 look a little different. For example, this icon here is actually like rainbow colored ish. And um and there's a lot of different other settings that you won't see when you're in there, when you're in the V1 version that are in the V2. So I'm here to help you guys out with that. So for starters, um you actually want to just delete this one, you know, this regular one. So I'm just gonna delete it all here. Um, because I'm gonna put the new DSR in this one. Actually, I'll just delete the whole thing. And for most people, the problem is that um, they delete it, but they don't really delete it. Like it's still there. So I'm just gonna delete the whole thing, all even the the WinRAR folders and blah blah blah, just to show you guys it's like where the problem is. You can delete all of these, and you might still get the problem. Um, so if you haven't deleted it already, just go ahead and delete it. Um, you can just get the new version. So if you look at this, this is the top search result when you type in DSR, DS4, but this actually is not the right one. You want to go to this one, to the second link right here. Download it for your PC. Click here. And then you can just download it. Okay, once you've downloaded it, you can just go open the file you want to extract. So I'm going to extract here. And it pops up right here. Just for convenience sake, I'm actually going to take this and put this on my home screen. I don't know why it just moved the order of everything around, but whatever. So if you look at it, this is what it looks like. You can see it's completely different. It actually is like this rainbow color-ish. It's like blue and uh, pink. Um, but when you open it, if you open it, you might notice that, hey, it's still the old version. And if you're not entirely sure, if you look up here in the right left-hand corner, you can see that this version is still the black version. Um, you want that new controller thing. I mean, you're, you're going to be missing options up here. And then, obviously, when you open your controller profiles, you're going to be missing even more options. Like, I know everybody's asking about the, hey, I'm missing the access config uh, options over here or whatever. Um, if you're getting that problem, which is uh, the main problem that I had, here's an easy fix for you. Press the Windows key on your PC and then type in percent app data percent. Um, once you're there, you actually want to go to app data local. Then you're going to want to scroll down to this temp folder right here. Once you're here, you're going to look for this one, this folder right here with all these, you know, blah, 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 blah characters. And then you're going to see that your DS4 Windows is still here which you need to just delete this whole folder. Some of you might actually have multiple of those folders and you want to delete every single one of them, all of them. They all got to go. That's what's preventing your PC from actually using this new one. So now if I go here to DS4 and I press DS4 Windows, I'm going to open it and you can clearly see in the top left-hand corner, it is the new one. My controller is connected. I have the more options up here that we're missing in the other one. If I go to my profiles, my new, you see I have all these other profiles and blah, 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 blah. And then um, from here, you can just set up whatever you want. For me, I uh, obviously haven't set up anything yet because I deleted everything and actually went back to re-download the old version just so I could show everybody how exactly you get the new version. So, um, yeah, that's about everything. It should work for you now. Uh, if you have any other problems or questions, feel free to ask in the comment section below. I'll try to help everybody I can. I'm no expert with it. I literally went through trial and error after a couple hours to figure out where that issue was. Uh, happy to get it, though. I hope you guys enjoy, and I hope this helps. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe if this video helped you. And uh, I'll catch you next time. Bye.